I am uh, Callistus Adita. Um, I'm originally from West Africa, Cameroon. Uh, I attended Normandale Community College from 2007 to 2009. Um, so being recent alum, uh, uh, currently uh, I'm a general surgery chief a resident uh, at the University of Wisconsin, uh, Madison. Hello, my name is Karina Moreno. I'm a Normandale alum. I graduated in 2011. Now I work for Metropolitan State University as a student success coordinator for Latinx and undocumented students. My decision to come to Normandale, you know, just like a lot of the successful decisions uh, in my life, uh, at the time seemed so unobtainable uh, and seemed like something that would never come true. Uh, I was actually still uh, in high school uh, back in Cameroon uh, when a family friend uh, who was here at Normandale at the time contacted me and talked about Normandale. Uh, he had very glowing things to say about the place and asked me if I would consider coming here and I said of course I would. I am from Mexico. Um and I was in the process of getting my permanent resident uh, here in the U.S. and, and uh, I wanted to continue to go to college. Uh, I thought it was going to be impossible maybe or, or super hard because I didn't know a lot of English when I was uh, in Mexico. And, uh, but my dad uh, told me that it was a community college close where he lived, so Normandale. And he told me that um, it was very diverse, that there were students from other countries and uh, that I probably was going to be, feel comfortable at Normandale. Long story short, I was granted and given a visa to come here. Uh, but my story again took another turn because when I came here and tried to enroll to start in the spring of 2006, um, I came in and they asked me for 2700 at the time. Coming from a you know, very poor family and seeing how things were, there was just no way that I could produce that amount of money. So I was actually forced to take two years off of school uh, at that time. Uh, so I went around and I actually maintained three jobs around in the community. I worked at Walmart, I worked at Old Navy, I worked at McDonald's, and raised a bunch of money in two years, and then came back. And, you know, when I came back, I think one of the things that was just really stood out to me is how the environment was just so non-judgmental. Everyone was so accepting, they were willing to help me and everyone invested in my success on campus. And as you know, someone, a teenager coming into a foreign country without really knowing much, those things were very integral uh, to me in helping support me. It was one of the best decisions of my life um, to, be a, to be at Normandale. I grew up a lot as a person and um, I had a lot of people around me, uh, staff at Normandale, uh, faculty members and students that, uh, that I was uh, very, very comfortable with and uh, people that, that care about me and help me to continue my, my journey. And I will tell you, leaving from here, heading to the University of Minnesota, heading to Oxford, going to medical school at Michigan and ending up in residency now, I haven't found a better place where I could really say, I, you know, I got taught better, you know, or the classes were better or the classmates were better. It was here where my foundation was set and it really set me up for success. Uh, my, uh, the degree that I chose to, to do at Normandy was business. I thought that I wanted to work for an airline and I had other uh, things in my mind that I thought that that's what I wanted to do. Um, at the end, uh, I know what it makes me happy now. It's to, to work for higher ed and to see uh, and support uh, all of the students that, uh, that I see uh, in, in my career. In my last year of residency now, I also just recently matched uh, at the University of Washington in Seattle, uh, where I will be a cardiothoracic a fellow uh, focusing on cardiac surgery. Uh, so in two years, uh, hopefully uh, this journey uh, that started here at Normandale 
uh, will really come to an end where I can then start you know, fully practicing as a heart surgeon, uh, which is what I truly love to do and I'm blessed and humbled uh, to have had the opportunity to be able to do that. Uh, first of all, congratulations to all of the students that have achieved uh, their associate's degree at Normandale. Uh, like I mentioned before, uh, having an associate's degree will open a lot of doors uh, for you. You will have to look for those oppor for opportunities. Uh, do not give up. You are graduating in one of the strangest times of our lives. You had to conquer a pandemic while struggling to graduate as well. And not only did you conquer that, you are standing here today as a direct product of your hard work, perseverance, and dedication to finishing whatever you started. Students that face uh, more barriers, I always think that they just those barriers help them to grow, to be stronger, and that is something that we can use for, for our future and, and that will help us to be able to achieve anything and everything that the students will wish for. An America that believes in everyone and just believes that if you put in the work and everything that you want to do, you're going to be able to succeed. That's the kind of America that we want. And I believe the class of 2021 is ready to face these challenges. Congratulations to you. We are all so proud of you.